everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, I have Alan Tarr from Roseon Finance with me today, and we are going to talk about this such an amazing project. And he's going to tell us what they're doing, what's happening, and why we're so excited to have them on the show. So thank you and welcome, Alan. Thank you, thank you, Lisa. Yeah, just so you know, before this, um, before this project came into existence, existence, I, I'm a huge fan of you, oh, and thank uh, you. I love you. And, you know, uh, you're a great trader, and you know, you're you're really friendly. I see that you you respond to most of your comments, and I appreciate that because you know I come from a business development and a customer service uh, background, mm -hmm. so. You know, people get lose touch of uh, being real and 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 really, really, you know, talk, talking and individually uh, reaching out to your individual community and your fans. And Thank it's, you it's so important. And I noticed you guys do that as well. So it's such an important thing to build a community and to have that support and to know what they want. And um, that's why I've got you guys on here today, because I know what they want. And I know that this is such an amazing project. So, um, so give us an introduction of what Rosie on Finance is. Right, right. So, so you know, um, we have this beautiful pink color yeah. and uh, the, the name is Rosie on. Uh, we're, you know, uh, obviously we're going to uh, have a nice, story behind that. I don't want to ruin it today, uh, but obviously it's it's related to beautiful, uh, beautiful things in life and beautiful flowers. And mm -hmm. originally we really wanted to build this application for for you know the, the, the new users, the the women of, of, of crypto, right? Because uh, in in yeah so in in, in, in crypto and in blockchain uh, the entire industry focuses on very technical aspect of thing. When mm -hmm. they start talking about layer two and yield farming, uh, or or you know um, all types of technical terms, you're losing the main uh, the other audience, right? Uh, yeah. The end the the simple users, the guys who just want um, to replace the traditional banks. Uh, they want to earn higher yields. They want to invest into crypto, blockchain, uh, Bitcoin, Ethereum, and of course, Roseon. So that's how we started it. And so, so th that's why uh, we built Roseon today. Mm -hmm. Today, if you were to, uh, to stake or farm Pancake, for an example, there's, you know, you have to hop onto three different platforms. You have to, to swap uh, to a certain token first, and yep. then you can then, uh, stake, and then you can farm, or you can uh, yield, and and all of that is extremely risky. So one of the problems is it's self help. You actually have to go into the individual platforms, and you gotta know what to do. You, you gotta do. know how to That's the hardest thing. So learning how each individual platform works, and then you know linking up your wallet is it you know uh metamask is it the the binance chain is it ethereum and it's like how are we doing that and it's like you sometimes have to have like a degree in like blockchain to be doing this exactly and and you know myself i've been in this space for 2016 mm -hmm. i've lost three keys in uh, in total uh of you know, I've lost a lot of money. Oh, and I've lost a lot of money. Don't even talk about that. It's like, we don't, we right? don't go there. It's like, I we know. don't talk well, about Fight Club. <laughs> it's, 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 it's ridiculous. So, and that's what we're trying to solve. In, in our app, it's literally two clicks mm -hmm. to engage in a yield farming uh, activity. So I'm going to put in um, into the uh, the video here because I've got the app on my phone. So it's available on like in the iStore, um, I, I store, the yeah. App Store, <laughs> and then um, as well on Android as well. So, but it's such an amazing like app and it's, it's really simple to use. Like you sign up, you KYC, 
Um, you've got everything in there. So you've got like NFTs, you've got, uh, you know, you can stake, you can farm and, you know, you've got your wallet there as well. So if you just want to spend some money, you've got the wallet. So, you know, it's, it's a really simple an easy to use app and I'm a girl and it's pink so it's cool yeah yeah, yeah. so so actually we're um we're launching tonight we're launching tonight this app uh the official app and we're going to launch three high yield farm so this is our true test you know we've mm -hmm. been working nine ten hard months to get to where we are today so today is a big day and thank you for having us here so we're launching this app today and we're exciting we're that is so exciting so you know i've been playing around with it and it's such a cool and easy to use app and it's like i've been in crypto forever and um you know these apps that come onto the market and they just are so difficult to work so like now I can go on there and I, like you were saying I can start farming with one click yeah, so literally click yeah and, that's and, it and and we have actually a news before the news mm -hmm. and is that we got our license so <gasps> our e wallet Yay! license congratulations our e -wallet license, our, yes and our crypto exchange license what does that mean we're allowed we legally can manage your tokens. We mm -hmm. legally can convert it from fiat to crypto and crypto to fiat. So we're That's working- That's a really major thing in crypto at the moment, especially with the, you know, onboarding the fiat uh, to actually mm -hmm. buy the tokens. So yes. yeah, and congratulations. We're fully compliant. Yes. Amazing. I, there's not many like companies that come into the market and actually make the effort to do that. So well done. It's like that is that is actually huge news. And especially like with all people coming new into the market, if they can onboard their fiat and buy cryptocurrencies with literally just one swipe. So yeah, yeah, yeah. So just remember the KYC uh, process is is normal. Mm -hmm. When you register, uh, open a new bank account, you still have to go through KYC. Yeah, and so that's this what is the thing. People don't about. understand that. So yeah. yeah, there's nothing we can do about that. We have to do that. Mm -hmm. but once you pass that, everything else is a click away. Yeah. That's exciting. So, yeah, because when you go into a bank account, so, you know, you're opening a new bank. I know in Australia, we need a hundred points of ID. So you go in, you need a, a driver's license, a passport, and, you know, a bank statement or something to verify your address. So it's no different from, you know, joining an exchange and doing it all legally. And, you know, it's all above board then. And you, you know, you're not sort of doing anything dodgy. And we know that this is a good project because it is verified and it is certified now. So that's really cool. Yeah, yeah. So so that's why um, a lot of people in, in the community, those are the early questions they were asking is, mm -hmm. is they don't understand how much work it is to comply and go through this licensing process. I am pretty much KYC, like, hardcore KYC on a number of jurisdictions. If something happens, it's very, you know, I am the target. Everybody knows me. Singapore, we register through Singapore, Estonia, Hong Kong, uh, Vietnam, and, uh, and, and yeah, so those, you know, I can't run And I, I know how stringent <laughs> the KYC is, especially in Singapore, like to get a financial license there, it is like you are jumping over hoop after hoop after hoop. So yeah, you, you really put the work in, which is really like the price as well since launch shows that. So if, let me share my screen a moment and I'll just bring that up. So, because for me, that's really important as well that, you know, when we're looking at the price, it's not actually massively dumping. So obviously the market has had a, a bit of a corrective phase over the last little bit. And that obviously reflects in every chart that we see at the moment. But we've got this strong support here that we're seeing sort of coming along. So 
to me, that is super important when I'm looking at any chart. So we see this, uh, this is uh, CoinGecko as well. So we've got, you know, what I like to call, this is a, a 30 day chart. So, um, and it's got alt court. Alt curl. So this is really important for me. This means there's enough financial support coming into this project to sustain it, that it's not going to just sort of disappear overnight. When we see these um, projects that are sort of flatlining, that's when you sort of go, hang on a sec, what's happening here? But this one's, you know, it's it's curling up and it's, it's doing the right things. And it's like you guys are building. So that you know, the community are seeing that you're building and that, you know, it's continuing. So it's, it's a really awesome thing. So well done on that. Yeah, yeah. So I have to thank, uh, you know, our advisors, Lester, he's amazing. You know, every time I have a call with him, I'm like, Lester, what's going on? Uh, how can you, how, have you seen a project below uh, XX price, right? And mm -hmm. he's like, just building out and focus on the fundamentals. I'm like, yeah, yeah, I am. We are, we are. Yeah, <laughs> so yeah. This, awesome. this is not just technical for me. This is a like fundamental. So this is um, when I look at a project that I'm sort of investing, I'm invested in this. So just for clarification. So, uh, and when I'm investing into something, I look at all of these aspects, not just the technical stuff. So I look at all the fundamentals and where it's going, what you're doing and um you know, if I'm if I'm bringing this to people, I want to be sure that my money is like invested securely, and that it's going to make good returns. And it's like, see, this is is really cool because you know you've got a collaboration with Polygon Matic. So tell me about that one. Oh man, Polygon is amazing. You know, uh, when we reached out to them, uh, they were very responsive versus you know other i don't want to name the other blockchains but you know they were very helpful they provided us with a dedicated uh, 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 uh tech personnel mm -hmm. to help us ensure that we onboarded uh smoothly so you know having that support from them and uh and you know they're, they're uh, what we like about polygon we we like Binance chain. We are yeah. a multi-chain and we will support all the chains eventually. But Polygon, uh, the original idea is Polygon was built for Ethereum. Mm -hmm. And we we know that Ethereum has the huge, the biggest, um, the biggest community, developers community, uh, investor community, and, yeah. and the biggest fans. And Polygon was built for that, is to improve uh, the the you know the, the the issues that uh ethereum had and it's showing you know it's able to onboard the ecosystem has grown huge oh largely. it's massive and, and it, and yeah it's able to, you know it's able to scale up it's able to scale up but again the uh, those guys are great mm -hmm. excellent uh, they're humans you know they, they give you very good uh, advice uh, when you need to and the support is amazing so yeah. what are we doing with them uh, we're launching tonight. We're going to support staking. The, we're going to support the token. Okay. We're going to support staking and farming, right? And but but because we support their ecosystem, now we can um, uh, integrate with anything in within that ecosystem. So any new NFT platforms, any new farming pla uh, opportunities, uh, we we can bring it into our app. So that will benefit. That helps our users and users benefit from the low low fees the um, it's the low fees yeah Everybody's so well, it's all staking about, matic yeah. is a no-brainer or polygon is a no-brainer because the price just keeps going up and up and up so you know if you can make money like on staking it as well it's like it just makes sense really so you you're talking before about like all of the stuff that you've done for kyc so um how do you plan to secure like users funds? Like yeah. how are you doing that? Yes, yes. So so we have about four layers of security. Okay. So first of all, the custodial service. Mm -hmm. We have uh, we have one of the top security team working on it. And and the idea is a mixture of multi-sig um, wallet uh, and then 
and then of course soft and uh, 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 soft, uh, hot and cold wallet. So okay. uh, we never have the entire amount of fund in one wallet. We're yeah. always moving on and off, on and off. Uh, to make sure that our risk is managed. Yeah, all, all of the major exchanges we see FNX has, uh, you know, hot and cold wallets, Binance have the same. So, you know, it's definitely something that we need to see in crypto in a lot of the exchanges, not just the larger ones. So, yeah. Right, right. And, and we're working with uh, Happy and, um, and, um, and uh, Shield Finance, mm -hmm. So uh, the idea is to uh, protect users' funds for any smart contract acts uh, or um, any, any issues with uh, farming. Right? Yeah. So us users' farms are now covered, okay? And then of course, we're introducing something really cool. Um, it's in the work and it's really is, is, is yield protection. So, you know, when, oh, when wow. we from, yeah, when we say we're, we're gonna give you 50%, 50% APY mm -hmm. and, and you're getting that or maybe there was a huge market uh, um, you know crash or something will we'll, we'll help will help and and uh, you know uh, contribute to some of that loss. Is, is that sort of like an insurance program that you can enter in there so yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. There's, that's a really cool sort of service that I've seen coming into the market so um, you know because Obviously, the volatility is why we come to trade crypto. But when we, you know, obviously all these new products as well, where we're staking and farming and, you know, you can literally lose your farm overnight when they go down 50%. Yes, yes. So that's why we have an insurance fund. So we're, we're allocating X percentage of, of our revenue into mm -hmm. this insurance fund. And then it'll be used for situations like this. So okay. when you start the staking um, and you're farming it and that sort of thing, do you buy the insurance fund then on top of it so that you so, mitigate so your risk? We're in shield right now, and the idea is into it into our app. So mm -hmm. how I envision this is to reduce the clicks and make it a very pleasant user experience. So when you when you uh, register into your app, uh, our app in yep. under preferences you can just say, please protect my fund and insure my funds. So by default, this is applied to all of your farms. Okay, so when I get my APY, then insurance will then be deducted from that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. that's, yeah, so it's seamless. I don't yeah, even know yeah. what's going on. I'm just yeah. like, I'm making money here and it's it's amazing. Yeah, yeah, so that's, so that's the idea. We want to make make everything as easy as possible mm -hmm. so you just and while you're farming and you know really farming is a couple of clicks and yeah. then you have nothing to do for the whole month if you're a short-term farmer so then you you navigate through our our nft gallery and and you know we aggregate we, we connect to open sea makers place and we can add as many as we want and one of our recent you know uh, partnership is with mosaic this is a really cool project where they're they're bringing NFT music onto, you know, they're making bringing music. Yeah, onto yeah, them. I have NFT. seen them. So, are, are they a yeah. Vietnam company? No, no, they're not. They're actually, uh, I think they're based. Uh, I'm actually not sure, but uh, yeah. by looking at the profiles, lots of them are 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 Asian based, mm -hmm. are Asian based, but lots of backers, lots of big backers. And, and when we approached them, we're like, you know, we're, we're in Vietnam. Uh, by the way, I'm Canadian, but uh, we are situated and we run the operation in Vietnam. But it's a huge, it's a young population here, like 65% under 35 years yeah. old. Very, very, very crypto friendly. So in Vietnam, I've like talked to so many projects in this region and it is just it's going to be the region that's just going to explode with, you know, people adoption, you know, people adopting cryptocurrency. And it's so exciting. Exactly. And, you know, it's a young population. So pop music, rap, rap is, you know, mm -hmm. becoming very popular here in Vietnam. Yeah. So I'm hoping to be that, you know, and then help on board and, and bring them on to NFT. Yes. Amazing. So, um, 
with the NFT side that you're talking about there, so, you know, what's the industry impact that you guys are trying to make with that? Like, uh, how are you different to the millions of others of platforms that we've got coming into the market? Right. So, um, so not specifically NFT, but I think what we are is we're focusing, and even to the founders, if you look at the founders and, and the, uh, the experience that we have, we're all, we're all enterprise. Uh, we've all worked for big corporations and enterprise. So we have the enterprise network and we can bring on a lot of new um, corporate users, right? Yeah. And these guys, they're not going to come in and buy one either. They'll probably buy minimum one BTC, right? Yeah. So we're hoping to, to, to bring on lots and lots of enterprise network and corporate users and new users. You know, we want to target the, the women and we've uh, positioned ourselves with, you know, our frontline team, our marketing team are all, all lovely ladies who are extremely friendly. So Look at our <laughs> yeah, no, it's so female friendly and it's like you know obviously you're not discriminating against men if they want to join you know they can there's there's no issues with that but like like me I'm a female and I would love to see more females in this industry yeah, so yeah, yeah. The, the truth is we have lots of male users it's just, it's just because it's they go they, they like the app because it's user the, for the user experience, mm -hmm. right? It's very easy to use. And that's what we're trying to do. That's what we're trying to do. So we have a market fit, uh, uh, very innovative app. And, and now that we're, you know, thanks to all of you guys and, and you guys you know, providing us with the, the needed funding, now we can scale. We're focusing on building and scaling the operation. Mm -hmm. So yeah. where, if somebody wants to um, find you guys, like, you know, if they want to buy Roseon, do they just yeah. buy it in your app or can they buy it on an exchange or where would you suggest is the best place to, to get started? So right now we are only on Pancake. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you can only buy um, Roseon on Pancake Swap. And then um, you can be a, a liquidity provider uh, on Pancake. And then you can also stake on Mantra now. So those are the two platforms that are available to, to access and then to earn rewards for Roseon. But tonight, obviously, we're, we're launching a big campaign and we're going to provide very, very attractive yields. And we're hoping that our early um, backers and early um, and, uh, um, you know, people who supported us uh, will come in and enjoy, um, you know, enjoy the, 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 the high APY and, yeah. and, and enjoy the experience, right? And then, of course, we're going to be giving away nice, beautiful, cute NFTs. Um, <laughs> and, then, and then there's more news to come. There's lots of, so, so after we launch is, our focus is continue, the tech team will build and mm -hmm. we will we will increase liquidity. We will make sure that our liquidity and our token is distributed everywhere. Amazing. So um, obviously that's today, like tonight, but from after tonight, what are the plans? Like moving forward, where do you see yourself six months and 12 months from now? And I know that's a long time in crypto, but yeah, you know, obviously you've got big plans for this. Yes, yes. So, so um, from the roadmap perspective, we want to support a blockchain a week, okay? Mm -hmm. So obviously there's going to be more integrations coming. And every time we have a new blockchain integration or a new platform integration, it opens up for lots of opportunity. So more NFTs, more yield, right? But, you know, we, we uh, the idea is we are a hybrid system. We're... Right now we're custodial service, but yeah. we're, we're, we're already planning and planning to build a DeFi application. So we are catering to uh, the non-tech and the, the, the easy, the user experience through our uh, centralized application. And then of course, we're building the DeFi application. So to build, to, build, uh, to bring in um, more volume, more liquidity, and, and uh, to, to, you know, uh, for more advanced users. 
Amazing. So um, obviously when you go into the, the app store, you just go yeah. in and you download Rose on Finance and away you go. And it's just, it's literally a couple of clicks to do this. So it's just download it. You open it up. You yeah. go straight into putting your email address. It comes with a secure code and then you KYC and you're off. Literally, yeah. that's it. Yeah. You don't need to know what liquidity mining means. No, you don't need to know what <laughs> any of these terms that we've just talked about mean. You just need to know yeah. that that's all I do. I can put some money into their fiat currency and I can buy crypto and away yes. you go. That's it. Yeah. Amazing. So, yeah, so I'm super excited about this project and we are going to be following you up as you go along. So I would love to have you back on the show next time. We've got some more big updates and, yes. but yeah, thank you so much for um, joining us today, Alan. And I'm going to put all your links underneath here and guys okay. don't forget to smash the like button because that helps people find us. Smash the like. Thank you, guys. Thank you. <laughs> Have a great night or a great day, wherever you guys are. We're excited. All right. Thank you. Bye now. <laughs>